Have a new restaurant from Food Network star Vic Vegas opens right here in the Valley today. Yeah, Chef's Black and Blue Diner even features some vegan options. Bianca Holman is there live this morning with a look. Good morning, Bianca. Hey, good morning, John. Good morning, Alex. You know, I got my cup of chock full of nuts coffee in this cup. All my Seinfeld watchers, you'll recognize this cup, right? So we are here at Black and Blue Diner joined by Chef Vic Vegas. Tell us what you whipped up for us. I already took a bite of this amazing waffle. So you took a bite of the amazing house waffle, and now this is one of the items that I'm big on. Vegan. Vegan steak and eggs. It looks so good. Cannot not have steak and eggs in Vegas. But this looks like a real egg. What kind of egg is this? Yes, those are easy eggs. Plant-based. Yep, plant-based eggs all the way. Plant-based eggs, plant-based steak, the potatoes done with margarine, no animal product, Good. cooked separately in its own green pans yeah. where you know, we're isolating any type of vegan food from any type of animal protein. Good to know. And uh, typically diners have pages full of food. You're overwhelmed, but here you've been able to streamline it. You got some great options pictured up there. Tell us about your choices for this diner because you've opened up several restaurants before. How did you make this so unique? I think the reason why this is unique, this is more of my food journey on what I ate to become a chef. Yeah. Growing up in Brooklyn on 75th Street and 5th Avenue, Staten Island in Jersey. My dad, my mom, they used to take me to these type of places. And as I became a chef and as I got older, living in Las Vegas since 89, I wanted to see it. I wanted to see yeah. it. And you have amazing diners around here that belong to Las Vegas. Of I course. said, you know what, it's time to bring some of my memories to this town. For sure, and tell me, I know open up a dur opening during a pandemic, it's already hard opening up a restaurant, but tell me the changes you all made here because you had to do some structural things to this old Arby's to open during this pandemic. You know, something that was a frustration, oh no, we can't build this no more. Oh no, we're, we're gonna have to wait. It was a blessing in disguise because what it did was is it allowed me to make the boots a little higher. Perfect. Separate people a little more, create a comfort zone, put dividers between the tables, exactly. and make it more of a pandemic-friendly restaurant. Even when the pandemic ends, yeah. let's keep this secure of a good feeling here when people walk in. So you got dining options, drive-through options, of course, delivery. You're doing it all to make sure that people can get a great breakfast, great lunch. Uh, tell me, how are you feeling? Because y'all are opening up here in like, I, I don't have a watch, <laughs> but uh, in about <laughs> 20 minutes, y'all open up at 7. Yeah, we're going to open up at 7 o'clock. Um, you know, it's, we're blessed to have you guys here, first of all, to let yeah. everybody know about it. And what we're just looking to do here is to be a staple for the people of Las Vegas because you don't really look at a diner as a restaurant. It's almost food you would have made at home, yeah. but you don't want to wash the dishes. And when you walk in the diner, someone's going to know your name as we get to know you. Perfect. Get your coffee ready, and we're going to know what you want to eat as we get to know you. Wonderful. So, again, they open up at 7, Black and Blue Diner. We're right here at Decatur and Meadows. Perfect location. Come out and support local restaurants, homegrown, and our great chef, uh, Chef Vic Vegas and his team. Thank you all for opening up to us. We're going to send it back to you guys in the studio. I need to bite some of this uh, egg and mushrooms. Looking so good there. There you there. go. A little vegan steak and eggs for you. A little hot uh, sauce on the it side. It looks to die for. <laughs> Bianca, did you try the waffle? Oh, I maybe she's busy eating the waffle. <laughs> it looks like she waffle. had a little bit. Yes, it was so good. It was so good. Yes, that was my bite. Perfect. It was good. Got the yes. strawberry, the whipped cream. I only took a bite because I'm ready to dive into that. <laughs> okay, well, go ahead, Bianca, and enjoy. Thank you so much, and we wish uh, we wish him the very best with his new restaurant. Looks amazing.